up everyone, Steve again from RC Tanks and Trucks 24-7 Toyan. First we had the rotors coming out, the single and double rotor or dual rotor. And now apparently we have a VA coming out. How sweet is that? Gotta love my Toyan engines. Now it's coming out, it's actually, I leave the link down below where it's uh, like a little bit of a blog about it. It's, uh, there's no actual links to purchase it as yet. But they have like a little, I think a questionnaire, what they're looking for and stuff like that. And just go check it out. But there are production shots of it and stuff like that where it's getting CNC machined. And I think they've learned their lesson from the, uh, the whole crank debacle for the L400, which is a four-cylinder inline four-cylinder, where apparently the crank, well not apparently, it did happen to Dennis and a couple other guys crack in the middle because there was no center support in the bearing, which... It's pretty silly, but I think they learned their lesson, and this one, there will be. Now, I don't know too much about it, apart from the specs that are on the website, so I'll read them out here. So it's going to be a 90-degree V8. The name will be a FS V800. It's got a cylinder diameter of 16.6 millimeters, a stroke of 17 millimeters. Displacement of 28cc. Speed range, or RPM range, which they call it, is 1,800 to 12,500 RPM, so that's pretty decent for a four-stroke. 4.3 horsepower at 11,200 RPM. Not too bad. It is going to be water-cooled, which is awesome. Um, electric start, and it's going to weigh around about 2 kilos. So, pretty impressive. So, like I said, go check out the link. When there is a link to purchase it, I will update that link so you can go check it out from there. But it does look pretty cool. It's just going to be a, a quick video. It just gives you an explanation in the actual link about what they've chosen, like a flat plane or a 90 degree, and they're choosing the 90 degree V8, typical style V8 engine. Kind of hopefully give you that kind of lumpy sound. Now there's a V8 Connolly, I believe it's called, but they're hella expensive. Not as reliable as well. I think they have crank issues as well. We never see them go flat out or balls out crazy. So hopefully this will be good. Fingers crossed. It looks like it. Uh, you can just kind of mate a traditional style clutch to it, like these ones here. If you haven't seen my channel, go check out the links. I'll leave the links down below for all these things. I haven't done this yet. This is another ready-to-run kind of kit it comes with a FSL 200 forward and reverse gearbox neutral kind of comes like this I'll leave the link down below I haven't done a video for that yet but uh, what do you think about that it's a 313 millimeter wheelbase so it fits any type of uh, 110 scale crawler so like I said that's an FSL 200 two cylinder awesome air cooled you can get a water cooled version as well there's another FSL 200A up in this puppy this is the uh Toy and sand screws, uh, sand cruiser, awesome, kind of world's first ready to run kit, four stroke crawler. This is a Sison V twin, it's like a Harley panhead motor, and I've also got a few other things. Um, the other L or the other V type of motor that Toy and have is this guy. So that's a four, that's a four cylinder V style motor. So imagine a, a V eight version of that pad boy. How cool would that be? So, if you haven't seen this, go check out the videos. But I have done a video on that as well. Done all of these. So that's a four-cylinder. This is all kind of old news to my regular guys. But uh, there's another two-cylinder. And this is what kicked it all off. Single-cylinder. How cool is that? So, like I said, I'll leave a link for all toy and engines if you want to go check it out. But, like I said, I can't have the motor with me. But I just want to spread the love, spread the word. There is hopefully going to be a V8 engine coming out. Should be cool. Hopefully I'll get it on the channel along with the rotors. But obviously they need to be made. Stuff like that. And shipping delays or shipping time and freight. It gets a little bit hectic. But I think uh, Double Deuce and I, Dennis, were uh, reading each other's mind. He just released a video as well about the upcoming V8. He's making his own V8 with two L400s. Slapped that bad boy together and he's made his own V8. I'm nothing to that guy. He's, he's like the... Uh, the Don Mega of uh, kind of putting stuff together and making them work. So go check out his channel. Awesome bloke. So Dennis, you got some pretty cool stuff. Hope you get the V8 as well. But uh, quick video. Like I said, I'll update the link when it becomes available. And uh, yeah, go check it out. Cheers, guys.